I have been dancing since I was about two and a half and I wanted to go to a college that was like close to where I lived. I didn't really want to go far away. Jacksonville's dance community isn't the largest. Um, so we actually have the opportunity to have um, people come from all different places and um, you know, give us classes and yeah, it's awesome. <laughs> My friendship with everyone, it's like I've known them for years. We clicked so fast, as soon as I walked in, they walked me with open arms like, yo. Professor Becca and Talani, they have both been um, not only uh, a teacher, as a professor should be, but they have been somebody to lead and to guide. Um, they're gonna stand up and they're gonna the, they're gonna perform the movement in front of me, so I can I can be able to to see what it looks like. They're gonna physically um, tell me what my body needs to look like for me to be able to perform not only their movement but to explore the movement that I have to offer as well. My favorite thing about dance has to be performing. Um, I love being on stage, that rush of adrenaline that you get, um, all those lights on you and, you know, can't really see the audience, which is probably a good thing. Um, but yeah, just being on that stage and just dancing your heart out. I was a b-boy, a popper, and everything else. Now I'm a ballerina male version. <laughs> the artistry of dance is always my favorite. Be able to create things, be able to defy gravity, defy the laws of physics is more I like to say it. Flips, turns, spins, tricks. I feel like being a predominant hip hop dancer, I won't fit in. They didn't treat me no differently. They gave me all the critiques that every other student got. And it made me feel like I can really do this. Like, I would never thought in a million years I'd be putting on tights. good starting point if you are wanting a long dance career and especially straight out of high school. It's amazing. Brilliant. <laughs> <laughs>